Detention Center Design Build Contract Announcement. Ms. Amy Tanami, if you would please. I'll be happy to. So as many of you know, I'll probably all of you know, uh, we've been working with the different contractors. We have five of them bid on the Design Build of the Detention Center and Sheriff's Administration Office. Last week, uh, the interviews were held by a panel of six folks. Um, we then took the interview scores, and the interview was worth 70% of their score. We also received cost proposals for the design side of both buildings alone, um, and that was 30% of their total score. So everything was very mathematical is what I'm trying to say. So after uh, the interviews and after collecting all the information, it was a very tight, um, I want to say race, but it wasn't a race, but uh, the scores are very close to each other. But the winning bidder is Nun Construction from Pueblo, um, and they have teamed up with RJA Architects from the Denver area. So we'll start uh, hot and heavy on contractual work with them, with the plan of starting to design immediately. Um, both projects we hope to be done in 2024, so get ready. We'll have groundbreaking soon. Can't happen fast enough, in my thought. But they, anyway. They've done a lot of work over the years in the valley. Mm -hmm. They they did all the remodel of the middle school here in Lahanda. They did the Manzanola school. They're doing the Fowler school now. So they've been around the area for quite a while. So. Very good, very good, and I too am ready to get this behind On us. the move. <laughs> where, where, where is the facility going to be? At this point, it's planned to be exactly where it's at now. Okay. Um, there is a lot adjacent um, that the county also owns, um, okay. but what's kind of cool is the they all presented with it there um, and gave the plan there, but if they come up with a better idea, we're willing to listen, but right now there seems to be the best spot. Any other questions? Thank you.